Welcome! For this video I'm going to show you guys how to play Sticky Chameleons. Now this is a very easy game for sure, but we'll go ahead and do a how to play video anyways because I really enjoy this game. This is a pretty fun game. Pretty fun little game. So uh, first of all with this game you can have uh, two to six players, okay, and it's a 15 minute game. The object of the game is to basically get these yummy tokens that's what they're called they're called yummy tokens okay you're supposed to try to get these tokens and the player who gets five of these first automatically wins the game now how do you get these yummy tokens well you do that by trying to eat the various insects that you're supposed to eat that are considered the plumpiest the plumpest uh most delicious insects here now, obviously, there's lots of insects to choose from, and there's even some uh, hornets which are not tasty in the least at all. Now, what you'll do is you'll roll these two dice to indicate what is going to be the juiciest, plumpest, most delicious insect here. So you'll roll the dice, and so we have a blue, and we have a spider. And so then... You locate where the blue spider is, and it's right over here. Then, after that, technically, when you're playing this game, with regardless of how many players you're playing with, you're all going to try to use these tons here at the same time, probably as well, at the same time, you're going to try to get that blue spider. Now, when you stick your tons, occasionally you'll get other insects as well as the one you want. And that's fine, as long as you don't get this. If you get the hornet, if you get this wasp here, that is a penalty. Meaning, even if you get the blue spider, if you have one of these on your ton, you do not get a yummy token whatsoever. You're basically disqualified from the round. So the other players playing the game, they still have the chance of getting that blue spider, because after all, you've been penalized because you have this. If you do manage to get the blue spider and you also get this at the same time, you have to take off the blue spider and put it right back on to uh, basically the table here. Now, technically, normally, when you get an insect that isn't the blue spider, let's say it's this green dragonfly, if you get this, and let's say I got this, and let me just stick it, good. So here we have this green, green dragonfly. You're not allowed to take it off by hand. You're supposed to shake it off. Now, as you can see, that does not seem to work. It works okay with the smaller ones. The, other, the smaller ones, if you shake them loose, they will come off. But I'd have to say it's pretty much impossible. Well, almost, there we go. It's almost impossible, like I said, to take those off. So if you get one of these big ones and you have to shake it off, there's a good chance you won't get it off in time, or ever, which will give the other players the chance to get that blue spider before you. So if they do, then they would get the yummy token, and you wouldn't. And that would be the end of the round, and then the next player in line would roll the dice, and we would continue with the next round. And the player that would have uh, five yummy tokens first would win after that fact. Now, if you do get the blue spider, so let's say I was able to obtain the blue spider. Well, I would just immediately take off with hand. You're allowed to do that with your hand because it's the one you're supposed to go for. And then you immediately put it back onto the table. Okay, that's what you do immediately for this game. Pretty simple, right? So pretty fun little game. Um, of course, sometimes you'll get these tons stuck to other tons. That can happen too. So you'll have to try to pull them off obviously, but you're not allowed to touch the insects that you get that aren't the blue spider. You're not allowed to take them off unless you have the blue spider too. Then you can take them all off and you can complete the round, and that's allowed. But if you had a bunch of other insects that weren't the blue spider, uh, that didn't include the blue spider, for instance, then you would have to shake them off, okay? You're not allowed to touch them by hand to take them off, which may or may not be an easy thing to do, obviously. But, um, uh, regardless, you don't want to get these, for sure, because those will definitely penalize you, for sure. Um, but that's basically how you play this game. Now, 
To keep these tons as sticky as possible, it's recommended that you wash these with cold water after each game. So I would recommend that. But if for some reason you forget to, or they just eventually wear out over time, this game is allowed to have up to six players, right? Well, the game comes with eight of these. So if one gets damaged or something like that, you've still got an extra one or a couple extra ones just in case. So that's really nice that they did that. But as long as you wash them real good, they should stay uh, pretty clean as well. And so let's see if I can do a demonstration on getting that blue spider. Now technically I would be trying to get the blue spider with other players involved in the game, and that would be hilariously fun trying to do so, but I don't think I can do it with with two hands, especially. So we're gonna just try it with one hand and try to do this solo. So let's see if I can get that blue spider without getting any of those um, wasps there. Or Now, if you do manage to get the other insects with the blue spider, that's allowed, as long as it's not these. So let's see what happens. I got it. The other one fell off, but that's okay because I got what I needed. So then I would take this off, this blue spider, and I would take a yummy token, and that would complete the round. So I would have my first yummy token. Really cool. Really cool. This is a really fun little game, for sure. So, um, I recommend also getting a bigger table so that uh, these insects don't keep falling on the floor. But, regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you guys liked this video. And uh, I'll see you guys again next time.